It is said, worrying is like a rocking chair. It gives you something to do, but it never subscribers welcome back to my channel this is called tea time with lady let's thank you so much for clicking worry don't stop the bad stuff from happening it only stop you from enjoying the good one there's six bible verses which encourage us not to worry in time of trouble joshua 1 verse 9 says have i not commanded you be strong and courageous do not be terrified do not be discouraged, for the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. There is not enough room in your mind for both worry and faith. Are you going to choose worry or are you going to choose faith? Faith is the substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things not seen. Also, Psalms 34 verse 4 says, I sought the Lord, and he answered me. He delivered me from all my fears. Proverbs 12 verse 25 says, An anxious heart wait a man down, but a kind words cheer him up. Speak over your life. Speak to yourself. Let me give you an assignment. Send a text message to yourself and call your name and say, Self, don't worry. God got me. Let us look at Psalms 23 verse 4. What does it say? Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. It is said that a day of worry is much more exhausted than a day of work. Psalms 23 verse 6 says, Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Also, let us look at St. Matthew 6, verse 23, that Jesus himself said, Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about itself. Each day has enough trouble on its own. You may also read St. Matthew 6, verses 25 to 34. Let us focus on the things of God and not so much of the material things. Put everything in God's hand. Leave it to God. Tell yourself, I am not going to worry. I'm going to leave all my problem and my situation in the hands of the Lord. When you are worrying, it's like you're telling God, God, I don't really trust you enough. My viewers and subscribers, worry doesn't move the hands of God, but faith does. Let's walk by faith and not by sight. I don't know what you're facing today, but leave it in the hands of the Lord and ask the Lord to fix it for you. Read the verses that will help you overcome. The Bible is very powerful, and when we speak the things, they will come to pass. As I often say, as long as it is lined up with the Word of God, Whatever you ask in his name, he will give it to you. <laughs> Exchange worry for trust in God and you will get progress. Tell yourself, God will work it out. Proverbs 3, 5-6 to six says, Trust in the Lord with all of your heart and lean not to your own understanding, but in all thy way. Acknowledge him and he will direct your path. I'm hoping that this video was helpful to you. Please remember to like, share, subscribe and leave a comment. God bless you. Goodbye.